The first days of spring in California may feel a bit more like Groundhog Day as yet another storm system pounds much of the state. That means heavy rain, strong winds, and mountain snow for at least the 12th significant atmospheric river of the season. Emily Schmidt reports on the streak of weather extremes. There's a bar in San Diego County along the Pacific Ocean where a sign reads, Life's at ease with an ocean breeze. But lately, the bar owner says the weather hasn't given anyone much of a break. It's been rough. I mean, we have two days of good weather, five days of bad weather. When, the, when it's good, it's good. When it's bad, it's bad. He estimates business is down at least 25% because of the weather during what would normally be a busy spring break time. Almost too quiet here. Almost too busy here. Some folks run away. We, we go towards it. The San Francisco Bay Area has seen 150 to 200 percent of its normal rainfall since the beginning of October. Crews in San Jose say they're trying to get as much mess cleared when the skies are clear as they can to prepare for the next round. It's definitely been a, uh, a challenge with, uh, after all the drought and then to get into the, this heavy, heavy rains. In the Sierra Nevada and Southern California mountains, transportation officials tweeted Tuesday visibility is at a quote, big nope. They urged people to stay home, noting they can't plow when blocked. With each atmospheric river, challenges are growing greater by the day. Three to four more feet of snow are forecast through Wednesday. In San Bernardino County, public works employees are activated for round-the-clock snow plowing. The governor's office of emergency services tweeted it has positioned rescue teams for the storm. I'm Emily Schmidt reporting.